My name is Brian Menina, and you can find my portfolio online at brian.jackalines.com. Jackalines, spelled J-A-C-Q-L-I-N-E-S dot com. Go ahead, check out my portfolio, read a little bit more about me. I started doing 3D animation about 23 or so years ago. And I'm currently the lead instructor and department chair of the animation program at the Milwaukee Area Technical College, where we started the animation program about 10 years ago. And it's going strong at this point. We're trying to grow the 3D community here in Milwaukee. But in the past, I've worked on some pretty cool projects for Briggs & Stratton, doing engine cutaways. That was a pretty cool project. Some of the stuff I've done for the Packers and Lambeau Field has always been fun work. This was for a DVD and the possible DVD cover. I didn't get the final version. My final version wasn't picked for the cover of the DVD, but I like mine better anyway. The Miller Bottle Races, these were done for the Jumbotron at Lambeau Field and played for six or seven years. Some other projects I've done partially as freelance. This is a freelance project that was done for CarQuest. Some other work here is showing just some basic things that I've done for class projects. I really enjoy doing this type of work with anatomy modeling and sculpting. So this was a pretty simple model in 3ds Max that was taken into Mudbox and sculpted to get all that nice fine detail in there. Another project, Max and Mudbox, also done for class projects. The teeth and eye close-ups, just showing what's inside this guy's face. The main project here was to make him talk. Got to have teeth and tongue and eyes to be able to do that. Like I even has pupil dilation, which was kind of a fun part of the process. And then this is really a throwback to a lot of my time in college, where as a fine artist in school, we did a lot of color swatch studies. So we would paint one color at one end and the other color at the other end, and then do blends through the middle and, you know, usually five or six steps in the middle to just have all these different processes that we've shown about how to mix color. My website's got a lot of cool stuff on it, but really there's a lot of detail up at the top as well about things I've done in the past, how my brother and I started a video game company. Pretty cool stuff. The video game we made is still out there for sale, even though we don't make any money off of it anymore, but it's out there. Go to my website and check it out. You'll be able to read about that and then possibly even go check out the game. Like I said, though, I don't make any money off it anymore, so I don't really worry too much about people buying it, but it turned out pretty well. It's a good game, and it's really where I got good at doing 3D. And my brother got good at doing programming. So now he's a high-end programmer and I get to do art-related stuff. All right, you guys. Have a good one. Thanks.